Hello friends, today we'll learn about soil erosion. Erosion is the process by which the surface of the earth is worn away mainly by the action of wind, water and glacier. Guys, too much rain leads to flood, and this flood water washes away the topsoil. This looks so harmful. Sometimes wind leads to erosion by picking up and carrying loose particles away and breaking off more particles. Also, glaciers erode the soil by slowly carving out valleys and shaping the mountains. Farming, cutting down forests, and the building of roads and cities are a few human activities that also lead to erosion. There are five main types of soil erosion. Let's learn about them one by one. Come on! Raindrop or splash erosion. The erosion caused because of falling raindrops on soil surface with crumbs the soil structure is known as raindrop or splash erosion. Sheet erosion. It is the uniform removal of topsoil from the land surface by the action of wind. Hmm, the next one is rill erosion. The most common form of erosion, which is observed during heavy rain through many streamlets and head cuts, is called rill erosion. Gully erosion, the head ward destabilized erosion which occurs due to the runoff of surface water along drainage lines, known as gully erosion. Stream bank erosion, the washing up of soil away from banks of a stream or a river is called stream bank erosion. Hmm, some of the greatest effects of soil erosion are loss of topsoil, soil compaction, reduced organic matter, poor drainage, issues with plant reproduction and water pollution. But we can reduce this in the following ways. Crop rotation. Growing crops in rotation reduces erosion as the layer of residue prevents topsoil from being carried away by wind and water. Conservation tillage. Conservation tillage methods such as no-till planting and diking leave field surface covered with crop residue that protects the soil from eroding forces. Contour farming. Planting crops in rows around a hill reduces the risk of erosion. Strip farming. Planting fields in long strips alternated in a crop rotation is an effective measure to prevent soil erosion. Terrace farming. Planting on hillsides in a step-like formation is terrace farming. Grass waterways. By planting grass in the field as it stabilizes the soil and provides an outlet for drainage. Diversion structures. Diversion structures cause water to flow along a desired path, reducing the risk of erosion. Planting trees. Aha! Very good, my friend we should increase vegetation as much as possible. Now you know a lot about soil erosion. Stay tuned for more videos. Bye-bye.